Hey guys, Shane here, Crypto Fish YouTube channel. So today we're going to get look into a little Tron Independence Day and also see uh, see what Bitcoin is doing and see what else I'm doing with my mining rigs. Be back in a bit. All right, so look guys, real quick. Um, be sure to subscribe, hit that bell icon below. I got something going on called Bitcoin Fridays where I give away Bitcoin every Friday. So be sure to do that real quick before we go on so you'll be notified uh, when you can enter to win. All right, guys, let's check out the news. All right, so let's head over to cryptocurrency news. Tron Independence Day underway. Make or break moment for the Tron ecosystem. Um, Tron is celebrating its Independence Day today as its token migration is set to conclude later tonight. When this occurs, Tron will become completely independent from the Ethereum network. Uh, treat, tweet out here from Justin Sun. Tron Independence Day live stream starts now. Join us to be a part of the free decentralized internet. Of course, that uh, is no longer available. That was earlier today. Um, Originally, the TRX token distributed after Tron's ICO was the ERC-20 token held on the Ethereum blockchain. Tron's mainnet launched just over three weeks ago, and its developers tested the mainnet code to make sure it was ready to support the new TRX tokens. 36 cryptocurrency exchanges took part in the TRX token migration. Uh, the neat, new TRX token supported on the Tron blockchain will be available to investors tomorrow, 26. Don't worry, if you miss the deadline to put your TRX on a supported exchange, you can contact Tron directly and they will handle the swap for you. Super Representative Election. Tomorrow marks the first day of the Tron Super Representative Election. The individuals elected will be responsible for the governance of the Tron blockchain. Governance has, made, has been ma a major issue with the cryptocurrency space, as many cryptocurrencies were formed last year off hard forks based on disagreements with the overall consensus of a project's direction. Prime examples include Bitcoin Cash and Ethereum Classic. TRX holders will be able to vote the representatives in, but the more TRX you have, the more voting power you hold. TRX price movement. At press time, TRX is trading at 0 0.0427 a coin, up 6.19%. It's not really that much. Um, while the cryptocurrency has only seen small spikes in its price in the last 30 days, the next coming months will make or break the project. Many of its enthusiasts are holding Tron, like me, uh, but potential investors remain on the sideline, waiting for the project's next move. I really don't know what they're waiting for. We, they've been making moves for months now. Uh, big announcements and even upcoming announcement won't boost the price of cryptocurrency anymore. Most investors are now, most investors now are educated and expect to see actual product results. Time to put your three billion money where your mouth is, Tron, or you may lose a lot more TRX enthusiasts. So, in a down market. Um, that price is not really going to move too much, so it is what it is, I guess. Uh, I just got a hold and hope that um, your investment in Tron, at least in my case, was a good idea. Um, some Bitcoin news. Controversial Tether releases $250 million in U.S. dollar. Twitter awaits Bitcoin price jump. So, looks like somebody invested $250 million, bought some Tether. And usually that means they're going to be getting into crypto. Stablecoin Tether, which was allegedly backed 101 by US dollar, has issued 250 more million more tokens June 25th, according to data from the Omni Explorer. So basically that's what's going on. Somebody has, or an institution maybe, has invested in Tether, and now they're going to more than likely invest in Bitcoin or some other cryptocurrencies. Although $250 million sounds like a lot when it comes to a multi-billion dollar market, it's really not too much and it's not going to make the price jump that much. Uh, tweet from Charlie Lee, 
Generally, this has uh, been a precursor of price going up. Tether gets printed when people deposit U.S. dollars to get U.S. dollar Tether back. This U.S. dollar Tether will then be used to buy crypto. This is similar to someone depositing $250 million to exchanges. Of course, that doesn't mean they will buy right away. Do your own research. So, some more good news, but like I've been saying for a couple weeks now, I think Bitcoin's going to go down even lower. Um, until some regulations get in and institutional investors feel more comfortable, I think that price is just going to continue to drop. I think last year uh, was just a crazy run, and was too much of a run. I think it's settling back down to where it should be, at least as of now, before institutional people come in. Four or five thousand dollars right around there is what I'm what I'm thinking. Okay, so let's see what what my rigs did over the weekend. 210 electronium mines and there's a little bit of a change here. Um, $13.73 worth of Ethereum mine to convert to Bitcoin. But as you can see, this new graphic, Moondex. I'm now mining Moondex. I'm going to have a video on that tomorrow, why I'm doing it. Um, there is no price on it now because it's not on any exchanges. So I just have it sitting up here at one cent. Um, I'll go more into it tomorrow. But what I want to do is I think you need 25 coins um, to get into a shared master node. Because I'm looking for other ways to make money. In this because the market keeps going down so I've been looking into master nodes and usually need a lot of co coins for that but um, pickaxe.mn I think it is um, is a master node where you can a master node like um, website where you can go see what coins are on uh, shared master nodes or actual master nodes so Moondex you can get on the uh, a master node to being on a what's called a shared master node where you just buy in at a little bit of amount instead of uh, 2,500 coins is what it would be to buy in a full master node for uh, Moondex. But you can throw in 25 and get a little bit of the um, little bit of the kickbacks instead of a whole master node kickback. But anyways, I'll have a video on that tomorrow um, and such. So we're sitting at 406.98. We did get a payout in Bitcoin over the weekend. Um, still under last week's total of 428. That's because Bitcoin is down. I haven't updated these prices because really at the moment it's not even worth it. 61.47 was last Thursday night's price. I think it's sitting at 62 something right now. Um, so I'm not even really going to bother with it right now. Um, here's Moondex. Um, it's basically a decentralized cryptocurrency exchange on masternodes. So that should solve the problems of people being able to hack these masternodes or hack these exchanges. Um, because now this will be running off a blockchain and not in a centralized location. So anyways, like I said, um, I will get more into that tomorrow. But... For now, guys, I think that's going to be about it. Um, if you guys have any questions or comments, put them down below. Again, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell. And um, I will uh, see you guys in the next one. All right, guys? Take care. Bye.